What is up everybody, Azario here and welcome to another ADS play that we will be beginning today and the game that I am starting is a game that came out I think a couple years ago called PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale as you see right here in the title screen. Um, the, the opening credits might start, you know, as I'm doing this intro video for the playlist. But uh, it's a couple things that I need to speak on. Um, you know, obviously there's been other games that are coming out this week. Highly anticipated games that unfortunately I was not able to play. However, you know, due to financial circumstances, I just wasn't able to do it as soon as I wanted to. Doesn't mean that there's not a chance that I won't be playing the games later on this month. Now, with that being said, there's been several games over the years that I missed out on due to the fact that I didn't have a PlayStation 3. So now that I have one, I feel like this is a, a, a great opportune time for me to do that. Since I don't have access to those new games right away, it'll be the perfect time for me to catch up on all these other games that I missed out on. And with PlayStation Plus, you know they do like a couple of new, new free games every month. You know, you have full access to them. You can play the full game as long as you have your PlayStation Plus. Well, I have a year PlayStation Plus membership, and one of the free games that was either from this month or from last month. I don't, I don't remember because I don't, I haven't looked in a PlayStation Store in a while. But one of the games was PlayStation um, All Stars Battle Royale way of trying to get their foot into that that uh, free for all market that you know games such as Smash Brothers were known for and what they did was that they took all of the known characters from the PlayStation world some not so known and they decided that brothers and you know, for, and from what I understand, like the game didn't do as well as they thought it did, but nevertheless, it doesn't mean that it isn't a fun game. I mean, some people, from from the videos that I've seen, people were playing like with cheap characters, like it was it's one character in the game that supposedly can shoot from a long distance, and people would just do that, like they would just stand to the side while there's this big brawl going on with all the other melee characters in the game, then they would just shoot the crowd, and that's all they would do, and. I don't know if those problems or whatever issues were that, that were with the game when it first came out. I don't know if those problems still exist in the game. But with that being said, there was like a 13 minute, uh, a uh, 13 minute patch that I had to install prior to me starting this game. So I don't know if that fixed anything. Or what changes they made to the characters, but this is going to be my first time playing this. So with that being said, let's get started. How how ironic I actually played. Like I actually went through that entire uh, opening scene, and I'm actually done talking now. <laughs> so with that being said, knowing how to play will greatly improve your experience. Would you like to go to the tutorial? Yes. I need to learn. Parappa the Rapper. See, that was a game back during the earlier PlayStation days that I wanted to play, but I never had the chance to. I miss Parappa. It's like some games from the past that you wouldn't mind seeing again. Alright. Like, it's really going to be funny to see how some of these characters play, because they weren't, you know... In their respective games, they weren't known to be like fighters. Like Parappa the Rapper, he's going to be one of those characters that's going to be fun to see, you know, in a game that involves combat. Prepare to be put down. Yeah, it's just like Smash Brothers. Like, as long as you're used to playing Smash Brothers, you pretty much got this game down pat. You, you just got to know what controls what, and you'll be, you, you'll be straight. Right, nice. Hitting points, attacks, 
Hitting opponents with attacks. Build your AP meter. Spend AP on super attacks to kill your opponents. Okay, attack your opponent with. Once you have enough AP to spin, carefully line up your super attack and unleash it. And hit R2. Boom. So that's how you win in this game. Okay, so it's like like the winning could it's pretty much like the same as Smash Brothers. The only difference is what they're telling me, or at least what it seems to be, is that the whole goal is just to build up your meter in order to knock them out. Opposed to when Smash Brothers, it's just do as much damage as you can, and the more damage you do to them, like the farther they fly out the ring. So that's pretty much what it's like. I'm getting angry. And it goes up to level three. Okay, so yeah, level one supers, level three, level two supers, and level three supers, and they're all different. Ultimate power. Yeah, I remember that about Parappa. Blocking prevents you from being incapacitated. Attacks and throws cannot be blocked. That sweet tooth from Twisted Metal. Oh, I see. Oh, that's kind of weird. Like the throw, um, is is that you have to flick the right analog stick. That's kind of weird. Yeah, like the throws are, are going to be interesting to use. You can evade most attacks by including super attacks. Old L. Uh, okay, so that's the uh, the quote unquote wave dash, air dodge. Uh, air maneuvers. Items can give special bonuses or limited number of special attacks. Drop held item. I wonder if you can throw it. AP orbs fall out of players when they are struck by certain attacks. Pick them up to gain AP. Ready, son? Okay. Victory. Ooh, victory. All right, so this game seems like it's going to be pretty fun. The fundamentals. Purchase new characters and costumes. So anyway, you can buy characters. I have to check this out real quick, because I went to I actually went to the, the to this video game's website, and I seen four characters. I don't know if, if those are downloadable characters for the game or if you can, you know, unlock them while in the game. Costumes, 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 costumes. No, it's just costumes. I'm trying to see if they have new characters or is it just costumes? Gravity Rush is Nevi Minion. Ah, uh, okay. All these different characters, or are they just... Mm. 
I wonder if they have like a pack where they can add all the new characters. Dead Space is Isaac Clark and God of War Zeus land on graveyard. Medieval inspired battle characters. I don't know. I guess it's one of those things I'm about to check on later. Because I want to see if they have the, an option where you can get like all the characters at once. Because it's kind of confusing trying to go through all of this. Okay, Emmett Graves, that's another one. That was a guy from uh, Starhawk. Another game that I had not played. They got themes. Nah. I'm trying to. No, nah, nah, that's it. That's everything. But they don't have a. Like every character pack. They don't have a pack where you can buy all the characters. Nah, it's just dynamic themes and junk. I don't want no theme, I want the characters. Oh well, screw it. Well, now that we got over that, now we can actually get to the gameplay.